Hey guys, you're welcome again to my channel. I have an exciting video for you guys today. Today I'm going to be showing you some of my favorite products that I've used for almost two years from Amazon and AliExpress. Now a lot of the people that sell on Amazon get it from China, so you find that they have similar products on both AliExpress and Amazon. In the link in the description, I'm going to give you guys links to both the Amazon and the AliExpress. Let's get into it. Don't forget to subscribe by the way. The first product we're going to talk about is this pedicure, collapsible pedicure thing. Honestly, it's literally one of my best buys when the whole quarantine thing started. And because I didn't have access to go to do my pedicure, it just seemed quite convenient. And because I live in quite a small flat, I like this because it folds away and you can literally fold it away and put it like behind the chair or behind a cupboard. It's so nice. I actually thought that it would leak at some point, but it didn't even leak. Like it's just such a great buy and I highly suggest that you get it for yourself. The second product that I bought that is absolutely amazing is this tissue box. Honestly, it's like a wet wipe tissue box. You know, that's a product you actually don't even know that you need, but you actually need. This tissue box holds my tissues for the wet tissues that I put in the toilet and it keeps them from drying out. So once I close it up, it keeps them from drying out. I think that this will be great for like nursing mothers as well who use a lot of wet wipes and you don't want like wet wipes all over the place. This is so good. You can literally pop out the cover put your tissues in it, your wet tissues. You can even use dry tissues as well, but I feel like it's great for wet tissues. Pop it back on, pop the lid back on, close it, and that's it. I am going to buy more for every single corner of this house so I have tissues. Moving straight on, I'm going to talk about this kitchen organizer that I bought almost two years ago. It's still really great. I put it behind my cabinet and that's where I keep like garbage bags, you know, dustbin bags, things like that. Just little bits and bobs that I need in the kitchen that I just don't want lying around. When I put it in there, it just keeps it tucked in and then I can close it and it, it kind of has the two tiny white tabs showing through, but it's nothing. It's like literally keeps everything away and I absolutely love it. The next thing are these jars. Oh my God. The jars in my kitchen. I keep everything from oatmeal to quinoa to everything. Gary, that's for my Nigerian people. They know what I'm talking about. Honestly, I love these jars so much. I use it to brew kombucha. I use it for everything in this house. I kind of use it to store things away in my pantry that I'm going to use for the next two months. And it keeps it, it makes it so beautiful. And these labels that you see on it are actually my own labels. You can shop them via the description box below. I made them for myself and I feel like it's just going to be such a great product for you guys as well. So don't forget to buy that via the link in my description. The next thing we're going to talk about, moving on quick is the steamer. I don't know what I did in my life without a steamer. Honestly, the steamer I use for my curtains, I use for silk shirts, I use for things that, you know, when you typically iron, you get creases, like these lines from ironing. So I use the steamer for things like that. And honestly, this steamer does quite a good job. I have to say though, it takes a few times of going back and forth to get some creases out, but it still does the job if you kind of stay put, stay on that area for a while and really apply that steam on it. But it really does an incredible job and every single person needs a hand steamer, especially like when you travel and you, your clothes get rumpled or you have issues with the iron, at least you know number one, it's not gonna burn your clothes and you'll get a straight hanging like outfit when you iron with the hand steamer. This jewelry organizer is the next thing on my list that is just like, where have you been all my life? Now that, you know, very soon, everything is gonna go back to normal, by God's grace, <laughs> and we're gonna start traveling again. I feel like this is literally the best thing you can take with you when traveling, especially when you want to pack your jewelry. Usually in the past, I would take my jewelry, fold it up in socks, and put it inside my shoes, just so that the earrings, because sometimes you pack earrings, and you find that the earrings, the back bits get bent. This keeps all the jewelry you need for your holiday, or when you're packing for a small trip, or a staycation, or whatever, and keeps it compact. It's such a beautiful beautifully made jewelry organizer and i feel like like where have you been all my life i love this stuff so much 
like it's just one of those things you're like why didn't i buy this you know what let me not repeat myself it's such a great product great quality as well well made you should buy this the next thing i'm going to talk about back to the kitchen is this lazy susan that i have that i keep my oil vinegar and all of the rest on i just keep the lazy susan so that i can kind of move it around and get what i need it's just a really nice thing in the in the kitchen and it just keeps my oils and stuff like that and i, I really like it you can shop that via um, amazon and there are also links on aliexpress as well now i don't know what type of person you are whether you use brushes or you use sponges um, i'm not the biggest fan of sponges because of how much bacteria they keep but i feel like this sponge is in a category of its own this kitchen sponge is kind of it's very gritty but it's gritty but it doesn't scratch i don't even know how they made this it's soft on the inside and gritty on the outside and it's just the perfect sponge for like when you have like dried on um, food on your on your um, plate it's just so beautiful and it when it's wet it becomes slightly softer and it doesn't scratch your pots which is perfect i really love this sponge i got this one particularly on aliexpress but i will look for an amazon link as well and link it in the description for you guys now this toothbrush holder is one of those bougie items i saw in first emoji and then when i was doing an aliexpress like haul i purchased on aliexpress guys ever since i had this um toothbrush holder it just made my cabinet look posh i don't i don't even know how to explain it like it's just so beautiful on like the cups and the ugly looking plasticky ones that you get you can literally just pop your toothbrush in it's beautiful it's made like with ceramic well made i love it it's just one of those things that you don't know you need but you absolutely need this white dust bag is literally <laughs> I love it so much. I actually bought it to keep like um, toiletries and things for myself, like self-care items, especially for my periods. So I bought it to keep my menstrual cups, my pads, my panty liners, things like that, just to keep them in a nice bag, you know, like a dust bag that will keep them safe. I quite like the rope on this. It just has a really nice look and it fits well into my um, my pantry. No, no, not my pantry. My panty uh, cupboard, the cupboard where I keep my panties. <laughs> <laughs> not my cupboard. I'm not. What am I saying today? You guys get the drift, right? This dust bag is just one of those really nice to have. And I suggest you shop this. Of course, I had to mention this hair mist, continuous hair mist spray. It's one of those things like I feel like exploded on YouTube. Every single person has it. But if you've never heard of it, this is a lifesaver. I love this stuff so much. This is what I used to mist my hair. And I love that it has such a fine mist. It's quite a fine mist and it's continuous as well. You know what? Someone gave a tip on Instagram that you can use this for your um, setting spray. So like, you know, sometimes you use like rose water for your setting spray. You can literally pop the rose or pour the rose water in here and put it on your face. Let me try <laughs> Let me try This is not rose water. This is just ordinary water, but let me try Oh my God. I love it. The mist is actually beautiful and it will be great for a setting spray. I know my face probably looks wet right now, but this, oh my God, guys, best buy. I think I got this one on AliExpress as well, but I'll put the links to the Amazon one as well. Okay, now we have this bubble remover. If you don't own one, oh, wait, like, have you been living under a rock? This removes all the bubbles on your clothes, like your old, it makes them look brand new. And I mean, look at how it's getting the bubbles out of this green um, jacket that I have. Like, it just makes your stuff look new. It's just incredibly good. And you just turn it on, put it over it, especially on a flat surface, and it gets all the bubbles out. Stop using um, shaving stick. You know, a lot of people use shaving stick use this this works so well this is another thing that it seems like a small thing but at the beginning of lockdown it was everything it's my tissue subscription honestly the amazon tissue subscription is literally the best even amazon subscriptions generally because we already have i think it has about 30 something rolls i'm not sure i will put that in the description box below but having just tissue bought in bulk was just a lifesaver i didn't need tissue paper you know but the only difference that i would say is that this particular tissue paper the presto by amazon is not as soft 
as the other brands it's slightly tougher so i need i need you guys to be aware of that but just having an endless supply of toilet paper is the best and i feel like i had to mention that in this video we're gonna move straight on to something that you don't know you need but you actually need and those are towels these towels i bought on amazon i think they came in a pack of 24 and honestly i use this for my face because i'm my face is quite sensitive and i break out very easily but every time i use this i just put them in the wash and I I wash them at the same time and then I use them again. Now, I want to show you guys the difference between the fresh one and the one that has been washed is that the one that has been washed it look feels slightly rougher than the fresh one. So the the new ones are very soft. They have a very soft texture, but once you start washing them and using them over and over again, the the texture is not as soft. I feel like I need to let you guys know that, you know, full transparency. But I still love them because all I do is roll them up in this basket like this and I leave them in the bathroom and I pick one every single morning when I am washing my face and at night as well. So this is something that I feel like washcloths are great for a lot of things if you want to use them around the house if you want to use them on your face get this one it's really really good um, minus the fact that it gets slightly rough after you've washed it over and over so these are items that I literally really love and use and some of these things I've used for almost two years in the, in the house so I suggest like you buy some of them don't forget that you can find the links in the description box below and please subscribe to my channel let me know if you like videos like this I'm happy to make more for you and I will see you next time bye